ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਹੁਕਮਨਾਮਾ ਟੁਡੇ ਇਜ਼ ਆਂਗ 725 ਆਫ ਸ੍ਰੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਗ੍ਰੰਥ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਜੀ ਬਾਈ ਸਤਿਗੁਰ ਰਾਮਦਾਸ ਜੀ ਮਹਾਰਾਜ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਤਿਲੰਗ ਮਹੱਲਾ ਚੌਥਾ ਹਾਰੇ ਕੀਆ ਕਥਾ ਕਹਾਣੀਆ ਗੋਰੇ ਮੀ ਤੇ ਸੁਣਾਈਆ ਬਲੇ ਹਾਰੀ ਗੁਰ ਆਪਣੇ ਗੁਰ ਕਾਉ ਬਲੇ ਜਾਈਆ ਹਾਰੇ ਕੀਆ ਕਥਾ ਕਹਾਣੀਆ ਗੋਰੇ ਮੀ ਤੇ ਸੁਣਾਈਆ ਬਲੇ ਹਾਰੀ ਗੁਰ ਆਪਣੇ ਗੁਰ ਕਾਉ ਬਲੇ ਜਾਈਆ ਆਏ ਮਿਲ ਗੁਰ ਸਿਖ ਆਏ ਮਿਲ ਤੂ ਮੇਰੇ ਗੁਰੂ ਕੇ ਪਿਆਰੇ ਰਹਾਓ ਹਾਰੇ ਕੇ ਗੁਣ ਹਾਰੇ ਭਾਵ ਦੇ ਸੇ ਗੁਰੂ ਤੇ ਪਾਏ ਜਿਨ ਗੁਰ ਕਾ ਭਾਣਾ ਮੰਨਿਆ ਤਿਨ ਘੋਮੇ ਘੋਮੇ ਜਾਏ ਜਿਨ ਸਤ ਗੁਰ ਪਿਆਰਾ ਦੇਖਿਆ ਤਿਨ ਕਾ ਹਾਵਾਰੀ ਜਿਨ ਗੁਰ ਕੀ ਕੀਤੀ ਚਾਕਰੀ ਤਿਨ ਸਦ ਬਲੇ ਹਾਰੀ ਹਾਰੇ ਹਾਰੇ ਤੇਰਾ ਨਾਮ ਹੈ ਦੁਖ ਮੇਟਣ ਹਾਰਾ ਗੁਰ ਸੇਵਾ ਤੇ ਪਾਈ ਐ ਗੁਰ ਮੁਖ ਨਿਸਤਾਰਾ ਜੋ ਹਰ ਨਾਮ ਧਿਆਏ ਦੇ ਤੇ ਜਨ ਪਰਵਾਨਾ ਤਿਨ ਵਿਟਹੋ ਨਾਨਕ ਵਾਰਿਆ ਸਦਾ ਸਦਾ ਕੁਰਬਾਨਾ ਸਾ ਹਾਰੇ ਤੇਰੀ ਉਸਤਤ ਹੈ ਜੋ ਹਾਰੇ ਪ੍ਰਭ ਭਾਵੇ ਜੋ ਗੁਰਮੁਖ ਪਿਆਰਾ ਸੇਵ ਦੇ ਤਿਨ ਹਾਰੇ ਫਲ ਪਾਵੇ ਜਿਨਾ ਹਾਰੇ ਸੇਤੀ ਪਿਰਹੜੀ ਤਿਨਾ ਜੀ ਪ੍ਰਭ ਨਾਲੇ ਓਏ ਜਾਪੇ ਜਾਪੇ ਪਿਆਰਾ ਜੀਵ ਦੇ ਹਰ ਨਾਮ ਸੰਭਾਲੇ ਜਿਨ ਗੁਰਮੁਖ ਪਿਆਰਾ ਸੇਵਿਆ ਤਿਨ ਕੋ ਘੁੰਮੇ ਜਾਇਆ ਓਏ ਆਪ ਛੁਟੇ ਪਰਿਵਾਰ ਸਿਉ ਸਭ ਜਗਤ ਛਡਾਇਆ ਗੋਰੇ ਪਿਆਰੇ ਹਰ ਸੇਵਿਆ ਗੁਰ ਧੰਨ ਗੁਰ ਧੰਨੋ ਗੋਰੇ ਹਰ ਮਾਰਗ ਦੱਸਿਆ ਗੁਰ ਪੁੰਨ ਵੱਡ ਪੁੰਨੋ ਜੋ ਗੁਰ ਸਿੱਖ ਗੁਰ ਸੇਵ ਦੇ ਸੇ ਪੁੰਨ ਪ੍ਰਾਣੀ ਜਨ ਨਾਨਕ ਤਿਨ ਕਾਉ ਵਾਰਿਆ ਸਦਾ ਸਦਾ ਕੁਰਬਾਨੀ ਗੁਰਮੁਖ ਸਖੀ ਸਹੇਲੀਆ ਸੇ ਆਪੇ ਹਰ ਭਾਈਆ ਹਰ ਦਰਗਾਹ ਪੈ ਨਾਈਆ ਹਰ ਆਪ ਗਲ ਲਾਈਆ ਜੋ ਗੁਰਮੁਖ ਨਾਮ ਧਿਆਏ ਦੇ ਤਿਨ ਦਰਸਨ ਦੀਜੈ ਹਮ ਤਿਨ ਕੇ ਚਰਨ ਪਖਾਲ ਦੇ ਧੂੜ ਕੋਲੇ ਕੋਲੇ ਪੀਜੈ ਪਾਨ ਸੁਪਾਰੀ ਖਾਤੀਆ ਮੁਖ ਬੀੜੀਆ ਲਾਈਆ ਹਾਰ ਹਾਰ ਕਦੇ ਨ ਚੇਤੇਓ ਜਾਮੇ ਪਕੜੇ ਚਲਾਈਆ ਜਿਨ ਹਾਰ ਨਾਮਾ ਹਾਰ ਚੇਤਿਆ ਹਿਰਦੈ ਉਰ ਧਾਰੇ ਤਿਨ ਜਾਮੋ ਨੇੜ ਨ ਆਵਈ ਗੁਰ ਸਿਖ ਗੁਰ ਪਿਆਰੇ ਹਰ ਕਾ ਨਾਮ ਨਿਧਾਨ ਹੈ ਕੋਈ ਗੁਰਮੁਖ ਜਾਣੈ ਨਾਨਕ ਜਿਨ ਸਤਿ ਗੁਰ ਭੇਟਿਆ ਰੰਗ ਰਲਿਆ ਮਾਣੈ ਸਤਿ ਗੁਰ ਦਾਤਾ ਆਖੀਐ ਤੋਸ ਕਰੇ ਪਸਾਓ ਹਉ ਗੁਰ ਵਿਟਹੋ ਸਦ ਵਾਰਿਆ ਜਿਨ ਦਿੱਤੜਾ ਨਾਉ ਸੋ ਧੰਨ ਗੁਰੂ ਸਾਹਿਬ ਆਸ ਹੈ ਹਰ ਦੇ ਸਨੇਹਾ ਹਉ ਵੇਖ ਵੇਖ ਗੁਰੂ ਵਿਗਸਿਆ ਗੁਰ ਸਤਿ ਗੁਰ ਦੇਹਾ ਗੁਰ ਰਸਨਾ ਅੰਮ੍ਰਿਤ ਬੋਲ ਦੀ ਹਰ ਨਾਮ ਸੁਹਾਵੀ ਜਿਨ ਸੋਣੇ ਸਿੱਖਾ ਗੁਰ ਮੰਨਿਆ ਤਿਨਾ ਭੁਖ ਸਭ ਜਾਵੀ ਹਰ ਕਾ ਮਾਰਗ ਆਖੀਐ ਕਹੋ ਕਿਤ ਬੇਦੇ ਜਾਈਐ ਹਾਰੇ ਹਾਰੇ ਤੇਰਾ ਨਾਮ ਹੈ ਹਾਰੇ ਖਰਚ ਲੈ ਜਾਈਐ ਜਿਨ ਗੁਰਮੁਖ ਹਰ ਆਰਾਧਿਆ 
से साह वड दाने हौ सतगुर कौ सद वारिया गुर बचन समाणे तू ठाकुर तू साहिबो तू है मेरा मीरा तो दुपावै तेरी बंदगी तू गुणी गहीरा आपे हर एक रंग है आपे बहुरंगी जो तिस भावै नानका साई गल चंगी आपे हर एक रंग है आपे बहुरंगी जो तिस भावै नानका साई गल चंगी सतगुरु रामदास जी महाराज स्पीक्स टू अस टुडे इन तिलंग रागणी Sadguru Pasha ji <coughs> tells us today of the state the awareness the blessing the consciousness of the guru and the relationship with the sikh and sadguru pasha ji begins by telling the sikhs o oh, sikhs har kiyan katha kahaniyan the katha katha here meaning the instructions the sermons the methods the forms the katha literally telling the path the pathway to god and the kahaniyan and the stories of the saints who have attained and walked upon this path where are they to be found these katha this katha of god of har of vaheguru and the kahaniyan the stories and the events of the lives of all these saintly souls who have walked upon this path where can they be found and guru says gore me te sunaiya my guru my best and my most honored friend the guru sunaiya told me these stories opened up this katha this sermon this instruction of the path these methods the pathway to vaheguru and also the stories of the lives of those who have walked upon this pathway both are found from the guru balehari gur apne i am balehari i am a sacrifice to my guru apne meaning mine to my guru to guru amar das ji gur ko bal jaiya i am bal jaiya i am a sacrifice again and again to my guru my mind is is sacrificed to my guru my body is sacrificed to my guru my heart is sacrificed to my guru aaye mil guru sahib ji says I come and mill join with me gur sikh o oh, followers of the guru gur sikh those who sikh those who learn from the guru i mill come and join with me and unite me with wahe guru unite me with the guru tu mere guru ke pyare now the fundamental thing to understand about this talk is tu mere guru ke pyare you are pyare you are beloved of my guru Many of us talk about how much we love the guru guru sahib ji saying to us telling us the definition definition of a gursik a gursik is that person who is loved by the guru it take it's going to take a bit of understanding to take that line into our hearts we may all say we love the guru but a gursik is the one who is loved by the guru why because the gursik's life is all dedicated to the guru's path and as the guru will tell us as guru ramdas ji will tell us in the rest of the shabad those people who follow the guru's path are pleasing to the guru people like bai manj who devoted his whole life to the guru he gave up everything he had everything he gave it all up came into the guru sangat came to guru arjan dev ji and 
after giving up everything, being cast out by his, by the fellow villagers, he came into the Guru Sangat. Firstly, the Guru put him through that test. Of him being ostracized from his whole village and losing everything, losing all his wealth. Then he came into the Guru Sangat and he would serve the Sangat 24 hours, sleep minimally and just keep serving the Sangat. And one day Guru Arjan Sahib Ji said that Who is this Sikh eating in the langar? And someone said it's Pai Manj. And Satguruji said to Pai Manj, Manj, this isn't a job. If you're serving the Guru's house, serve fully. And so from that day, Pai Manj gave up eating in the langar and he'd eat. Whatever prashadda pani, whatever roti, whatever hadn't been eaten by the Sangat, whatever food was made but hadn't been eaten. And Guru Sahib Ji said, Still, you must give up your attachment to material goods. And then Pai Manj even gave, the, gave that up and he'd cut wood for the Sangat. Then he'd cut a little bit of wood for himself, sell that, and out of that money buy food and subsist upon that. And one day when he was doing this, he fell into a well. And when he fell into the well, he had the wood, the firewood of the Guru's house upon his head. And Pai Manj, for all the time, the many hours he was in the well, he was just remembering Guru Arjan Dev Ji. And he kept the wood upon his head, he kept his hands up in the air around the wood, because he didn't want the wood to get wet. And when Pai Manj fell into the well, Guru Sahib Ji, Guru Arjan Dev Ji ran barefoot from Harmandar Sahib, from the Golden Temple. And they went to the well to get him out. And when they said, Pai Manj, come out of the well, Pai Manj said, first take this wood. First take the firewood of the Guru's house. That is more important to me. My seva is the most important thing. My service is the most important thing. They took the wood out. Then Pai Manj came out. And when Pai Manj came out, Guru Arjan Dev Ji said, Manj Piyara Guru Ko. Guru Manj Piyara. Manj is Piyara. Pai Manj is my Piyara. He's, he's loved by me. Guru Manj Piyara. And the Guru is loved by Pai Manj. And they said to Pai Manj, Pai Manj, ask for something. And Pai Manj said, Guru Sahib Ji, if there's one thing I ask for is that you never put a Sikh through the trials and tribulations which you put me through. And when Pai Man said this, Guru Arjan Dev Ji took him into an embrace and said, Manj Guru Ka Bohita Jag Langanhara, Pai Man Ji will be like a boat to ship across other souls from this ocean of the world. So Guru Sahib Ji says, Tu mere Guru Ke Pyaare, you are the ones who are beloved by my Guru, like Pai Man Sahib Ji. Those who have pleased the Guru, those who are loved by the Guru, they are Gursik, Rahao. Guruji says, pause and think about this. Har ke gun har pavde se Guru te paaye. How can we pavde? How can we please Hari Vahe Guru? And Guru Sahib Ji says, you must get together Har ke gun. You must gather within you the virtues of Hari, the virtues of Lord. Say Guru te paaye. And where are they found from? The Guru. If you are going to merge in with the Almighty, you must take on the, vir- the virtues of the Almighty. How can we do this? By s- obtaining the gorn, by singing the praises of the Almighty, by singing Nirpao, Nirpao, Nirpao again and again. With the Guru's grace, you will merge into that fearless, into that Nirpao. So sing the praises and take on the praises as much as you can. Say Guru Te Pai and the wisdom for singing and for taking on the virtues and taking on the pra- uh, uh, the qualities of bhakti, of devotion, are found from the Guru. 
ਜਿਨ ਗੁਰ ਕਾ ਭਾਣਾ ਮੰਨਿਆ ਦਾ ਉਸ ਹੂ ਹਵ ਮੰਨਿਆ ਹੂ ਐਕਸੈਪਟਡ ਦ ਗੁਰੂਸ ਭਾਣਾ ਦ ਗੁਰੂਸ ਵਿਲ ਦ ਗੁਰੂਸ ਕਮਾਂਡ ਤਿਨ ਕੋਮ ਕੋਮ ਜਾਏ ਗੁਰੂ ਸੀ ਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਸੇਸ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਕੋਮ ਕੋਮ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਸੈਕਰੀਫਾਈਸ ਅਗੇਨ ਐਂਡ ਅਗੇਨ ਟੂ ਦੋਸ ਜਿਨ ਸਤਗੁਰ ਪਿਆਰਾ ਦੇਖਿਆ ਦ ਉਸ ਹੂ ਹਵ ਸੀਨ ਮਾਈ ਪਿਆਰਾ ਮਾਈ ਬਿਲਵਡ ਸਤਗੁਰੂ ਵਿਦ ਦੇ ਆਈਸ ਤਿਨ ਕੋ ਹਵ ਵਾਰੀ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਵਾਰੀ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਆਈ ਸੈਕਰੀਫਾਈਸ ਟੂ ਦੇਮ ਜਿਨ ਗੁਰ ਕੀ ਕੀਤੀ ਚਾਕਰੀ ਦ ਉਸ ਹੂ ਹਵ ਸਰਵਡ the guru those who have done the guru's chakri chakri that is which is done with the hands that's uh, that seva which is performed with the hands and that seva which is performed with cha with a longing with a hope with a desire with happiness with glee with joy that is chakri those people who have gleefully joyfully served the guru then sadbale hari forever i am a sacrifice forever i am devoted to them ਹਾਰੇ ਹਰ ਤੇਰਾ ਨਾਮ ਹੈ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਯੋ ਨਾਮ ਯੋ ਨੇਮ ਇਜ਼ ਹਰੀ ਹਰ ਹਰ ਓ ਹਰੀ ਓ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਯੋ ਨੇਮ ਇਜ਼ ਦ ਵਨ ਵਿਚ ਬ੍ਰਿੰਗਸ ਹਰੀ ਵਿਚ ਬ੍ਰਿੰਗਸ ਲਾਈਫ ਟੂ ਆਲ ਦੁਖ ਮੇਟਨ ਹਰਾ ਐਂਡ ਇਜ਼ ਦ ਮੇਟਨ ਹਰਾ ਐਂਡ ਇਜ਼ ਦ ਡਿਸਟਰੋਇਰ ਆਫ ਦੁਖ ਆਫ ਪੇਨ ਗੁਰ ਸੇਵਾ ਤੇ ਪਾਈ ਹੈ ਐਂਡ ਇਟ ਇਜ਼ ਪਾਈ ਹੈ ਵੇਅਰ ਇਜ਼ ਇਟ ਫਾਉਂਡ ਫ੍ਰੋਮ ਦ ਸੇਵਾ ਬਾਈ ਸਰਵਿੰਗ ਦ ਟਰੂ ਗੁਰੂ ਐਂਡ ਬਾਈ ਸਰਵਿੰਗ ਦ ਟਰੂ ਗੁਰੂ ਵਾਟ ਵਿਲ ਯੂ ਫਾਈਂਡ ਵਾਟ ਵਿਲ ਯੂ ਬਿਕਮ ਯੂ ਵਿਲ become a gurmuk you will follow the guru wherever attain that state of gurmuk tai and by doing so nistara comes liberation jo hare naam te aaye de guru sahib guru sahib ji says those who te aaye de who meditate upon the hari naam upon the name of the lord te jan parwana those humble servants those jan a parwana are accepted in the court of the lord tin vit ho nanak varya ਵਿਟ ਹੋ ਟੂ ਥੈਮ ਨਾਨਕ ਸਤਗੁਰੂ ਪਾਸ਼ਾ ਜੀ ਸੇਸ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਵਾਰਿਆ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਅ ਸੈਕਰੀਫਾਈਸਡ ਅਗੇਨ ਐਂਡ ਅਗੇਨ ਸਦਾ ਸਦਾ ਕੁਰਬਾਨਾ ਫੋਰਐਵਰ ਐਂਡ ਫੋਰਐਵਰ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਡਿਵੋਟਿਡ ਟੂ ਥੈਮ ਸਾ ਹਰ ਤੇਰੀ ਉਸਤਤ ਹੈ ਜੋ ਹਰ ਪ੍ਰਭ ਭਾਵ ਹੈ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਦੈਟ ਇਜ਼ ਯੋਰ ਉਸਤਤ ਦੈਟ ਇਜ਼ ਯੋਰ ਪ੍ਰੇਜ਼ ਐਂਡ ਸਾ ਓਨਲੀ ਦੈਟ ਇਜ਼ ਯੋਰ ਪ੍ਰੇਜ਼ ਜੋ ਹਰ ਪ੍ਰਭ ਭਾਵ ਹੈ ਵਿਚ ਪਲੀਜ਼ਸ ਯੂ ਮੈਨੀ ਪੀਪਲ ਟਰਾਈ ਇਨ ਦੇਅਰ ਓਨ ਵੇਜ਼ to reach the lord but the lord can only be found through the guru and the guru tells us these are the ways this is the path jo gurmukh pyara sevde those who serve that beloved gurmukh the mukhi guru the primal guru guru nanak sevde those who serve that guru then har phal paave they find the phal the fruit of their labor which is hari which is wahe guru jina har se ti pirhadi those who have pirhadi those who have love for hari for wahiguru tina ji prab nale their ji their souls are always with wahiguru they always merged in forever and forever and they live their lives knowing that god is always with them that prab that wahiguru is always with them oy jap jap pyara jeev de by jap by meditating with their mind body and soul with their man bani sri their mind bani their words and their sarir with their body oye jap pe jap pyara jeev de that is their life that is where they find life from from meditating upon the guru eternal life har naam samale and they samale they forever and forever gather together and get together the name of wahiguru jin gurmukh pyara sevya those who have served my pyara my beloved guru my primal guru the mukhi guru the guru of all gurus those who have served my guru my guru nanak sahib tin ko kum jaya i am ko i am a sacrifice to them i am devoted to them oye aap shute they themselves are shute are liberated parivar se and their whole parivar their whole families all those who meet them sab all those who meet them jagat this whole world shudaya is serve is saved through, through them is liberated through them ਗੁਰ ਪਿਆਰਾ ਹਰ ਸੇਵਿਆ ਗੁਰ ਧੰਨ ਗੁਰ ਧੰਨੋ ਮਾਇ ਪਿਆਰਾ ਮਾਇ ਬਿਲਵਡ ਗੁਰੂ ਹੂ ਹੈ ਸੇਵਿਆ ਹੂ ਹੈ ਸਰਵ ਦ ਲੋਰਡ ਗੁਰ ਧੰਨ ਦ ਗੁਰੂ ਇਜ਼ ਬਲੈਸਡ ਗੁਰ ਧੰਨੋ ਦੋਸ ਪੀਪਲ ਹੂ ਮੀਟ ਵਿਦ ਦ ਗੁਰੂ ਦੇ ਆਰ ਬਲੈਸਡ ਐਸ ਵੈਲ ਦੋਸ ਪੀਪਲ ਹੂ ਫੋਲੋ ਦ ਗੁਰੂ ਆਰ ਬਲੈਸਡ ਗੁਰ ਹਰ ਮਾਰਗ ਦੱਸਿਆ ਦ ਗੁਰੂ ਹੈਸ ਟੋਲਡ ਮੀ ਦ ਮਾਰਗ ਦ ਪਾਥ ਆਫ ਹਰੀ ਆ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਗੁਰ ਪੁੰਨ ਵੱਡ ਪੁੰਨੋ ਦ ਗੁਰੂ ਹੈਜ਼ carried out the vadpanno the greatest act of kindness 
The greatest act of kindness is turning on the light in the darkness, which is what the Guru has done. Jo Gur Sikh, those Gur Sikh, those Sikhs of the Guru, Gur, Gur Sevade, who serve the Guru, Se Punna Prani, those Prani, those humble beings, are the most Punna, are the most blessed out of the, out of the whole world. Jan Nanak Tinako Varya. Guru Sahib Ji says that even I am their Jan, their servant, Tinako Varya, and I'm sacrificed to them. Sada Sada Kurbani, forever and forever I'm devoted to them. Gurmuk Sakhi Sahi Liya. Those Sakhis Ehliya, those friends and that Sangat who follow the Guru completely, who are Gurmukh, say Aap Har Paiya. They have Paiya, they have pleased Vaheguruji himself. Har Dargah Pernaiya. And in the court of the Lord, they are Pernaiya, they are given robes of honor. What robe of honor are they given? They are given the robe of Brahmagyan, of complete consciousness of the Lord. Hare Aap Galilaya. And Vaheguruji Galilaya. Gal means with their embrace. Laya means take into, takes them into the, into the embrace of complete consciousness. Of eternity, consciousness and bliss. Sat Chit Anand. They become part of that Lord. Like Guru Nanak and Guru Angad Dev Ji. How Guru Angad Sahib Ji became an Angad, a part of Guru Nanak Sahib Ji. Jo Gurmukh Naam Te Aide, those people who Te Aide, those Gurmukh, those followers of the Guru, those people who keep the Guru Mukh, who keep the Guru always upon their tongue, upon their mouth, Naam Te Aide, and meditate upon the Naam, the name of the Lord. Tin Darsan Dija Guru Sahib Ji says, Please bless me with a blessed vision of those Gursik. By seeing those who meditate upon the Lord, I see the Lord Himself. Ham tinke charan pakhal de. Maharaj ji says, I pakhal de. I wash their charan, their feet. Tood and the dust which comes off. That water which comes off. Kool, kool pije. I wash it again and again and I drink it. And what does that mean? Ham tinke charan pakhal de. I fall at the feet of those gursik. Why? Because when you go to learn, you must fall at the feet. There must be no ego. And Guru Sahib Ji is telling us the way when we go to ask those great Gursikhs the path. We must give up our ego, fall to their feet, and truly the Upadesh, the message they give us, we must take that into our very soul, that Tur, that Upadesh, those words which they give us, take that at like the physical act of drinking, imbibing, we must take that into our very soul. Just like that water becomes part of us, we must make the words and the message of those Gursiks part of us. Paan Supari Khatiya Those who have eaten Paan Supari, the beetle nuts and the beetle leaves, Mukbiriya laya, and those people who have put biriya, put tobacco, cigarettes into their mouth, biriya also to, also means excessive fashions. Those who have indulged in this lion, Guru Sahib is telling us the beetle nuts and the beetle leaf are a type of drug. As is the cigarettes and the drug of excessively dressing ourselves up in order to please our desires. Guru Sahib Ji is talking about all of those things in this line. And Guru Sahib Ji is saying that those people who have ruined the body, the, the this physical temple which we have been given, this body, by... Smoking by living their lives in excessive pleasures. Har har kadena chetyo. Never do they chetyo remember, do they meditate upon Hari, upon that Vaheguru. Jam pakad chalaya. And in the end, they are pakad, they are grabbed hold of by the jam, by the messengers of death, and chalaya, and they are taken away. Guru Sahib Ji is warning us here. 
of falling into these worldly tastes and it's also must be mentioned at this point that even Guru Gobind Singh Ji Maharaj's koda, even the horse of Guru Gobind Singh Ji wouldn't put a foot into a field of tobacco. So those people who break up this body, Guru Sahib Ji tells us what happens to them. Jinn hari naam ma hari chetia. Those people who have chetia, who have meditated upon the Hari Naam, the name of the Lord, hirdai urtaare and have taare, have Embedded it within their or within their heart, or meaning heart. Those people who have taken the Guru's message into their heart, taken the Naam into their heart, Jam, the messengers of death, the angels of death, don't even come close to them. Because they are loved by the Guru, and because they are Sikhs of the Guru, because they follow the Guru. They have followed the Guru and therefore are loved by the Guru. Harka Naam Nitan hai. The name of Vaheguru is the Nidan, is the true treasure. Koi Gurmukhajane, but only very few people who are focused upon the Guru Jana come to understand this. Nanak Jin Satguru Petya, those who have Petya, who have truly been united, who have merged into the Guru, the true Guru, the Satguru. Rangraliya Mane, they are forever and forever blessed with Rangraliya. Rangraliya meaning pleasures and peace, the true pleasure of peace. Satgur Data Yakiya. The true Guru is the true Data, the true giver. And he is the only one who we can akia, who we can call a giver. Everyone else. As Guru Teg Bahadur Sahib Ji says, Jagat Pikari Pirata hai. Sabko Data Ram. The whole world is begging. And the one giver is God. Satgur Data Yakiya. The true Guru is the only giver in this world. Tosakare Pasao. And when he is tos, when he is pleased. Kare Pasao, he grants everything upon his servant. Ho Guru Vitto Ho Sad Varia, I am Vitto Ho to the Guru, I am Sad forever and forever Varia, a sacrifice. Jin Dittara now, who has Dittara, who has blessed me with the now, the name of the Lord. So Tan Guru Sa Basaha, the Guru is done, the Guru is blessed. All hail the Guru Sa Basaha. Great and glorious is the Guru. Har de Saneha. Who de who gives us the Saneha, the message of Hari, of Vaheguru. How vek vek Guru vigseya. By vek vek looking upon the Guru again and again. Reading the Guru's Bani. Doing the Guru's Darshan. The blessed, seeing the blessed vision of the Guru. Vigseya. My body, my mind, my soul blossoms. Vigseya means to blossom, to rejoice. Gur Sat Gur Deha, seeing the Deha, the body of the true Guru. When Painandalal Ji asked Guru Gobind Singh Ji how many forms there were of the Guru, Guru Gobind Singh Ji said, Teen Roop Hai Mohe Ke Sunaho Nand Chet Lai. Painandalal Singh Ji, there are three forms of the Guru. Guru Gobind Singh Ji says, Sunaho Nand Chet Lai. Nirgun Sargun Guru Shabd Kahoho Tohe Smajai The first form of the Guru is that formless Lord who is pervading through all. The second is the Sargun, the form, the physical body, which was embodied from Guru Nanak Dev Ji to Guru Govind Singh Ji and now resides in the Panj Pyare in the five beloved ones who are Complete in their in their rahat, and the third form is the Guru Shabat, the Guru's words, the Sri Guru Granth Sahib Ji. That is the third form. That is the third embodiment. And Gurmukh Pyare, great beloved souls, have explained that the rags are like the angs, the organs of the Guru. Jabji Sahib is like the face of the Guru. Brahm Gyan is like the mouth of the Guru, the consciousness of Brahm Gyan, the consciousness of the Lord. Prok and Aprok Gyan, the wisdom of practicing, that practicing wisdom 
Aprochyan, that wisdom which is gained through meditating upon God, that experience of the divine and the message of the divine, Prokhyan, which tells us about the divine, those are the two eyes of the Guru. The Gyan, the knowledge of, of Akalapat, of being beyond desire, is like the case of the Guru. And Pagti, devotional worship, is like the, the star of the Guru. Gurmukh Pyare have described the Guru, the Guru Shabbat, in this way. So, Gur Sat Gur Deha, seeing this form, this body of the Guru, I blossom forth. Gur Rasna Amrit Boldi, the Guru's Rasna, the Guru's tongue, always speaks Amrit, always is giving forth immortal nectar. Had a naam Sohavi and is Sohavi, it is embellished with the naam, the name of the Lord, forever and forever. Jin Sona Sikha Gur Mannya. Those Sikhs who have sorn, who have listened and have mannya and have obeyed. Tina Puk Sabjavi, all of their puk, all of their hungers, spiritual and physical and mental, Sabjavi, all of those hungers are fulfilled. हर का मार गया कि ये कहो कित बिद जाइए the मार्ग the path of हरि या वाहि गुरु कहो कित बिद जाइए in which bid in which way do I climb this which way do I walk upon this हरे हरे तेरा नाम है the name of हरि या वाहि गुरु is the path हर खर्च ले जाइए and the supplies that you need upon this path are is that name of the Lord, that courage, this this path is the Lord's name is the path and the Lord's name is also the supplies that are needed upon that path. Jin Gurmukh Har Aradhya, those Gurmukhs, those followers of the Guru, those people who keep the Guru upon their tongue and keep the Guru, Keep meditating upon the Guru with the tongue at all times. Har Aradhya and have meditated upon Hari, upon the Lord. Say Sah. They are the most wealthy. Vad Dane. And they are the great givers. And Dane also means wise. They are the wisest. Because material wealth comes and goes, but spiritual wealth, once gathered, remains for eternity. Ha Satguru ka Sad Varya. I am Sad forever. Varya. Devoted in sacrifice to the Satguru, to the true Guru, Guru Bachan Samane, because through the Guru's Bachan, through the Guru's words, I have Samane, I have merged into the Almighty God. Tu Thakur, you have been my Lord, O Vaheguru, you are my Lord. Tu Sahibu, you are my Master, Tu Hai Mira Mira, you are my King, you are my Sovereign, O Lord God. Tu Dpava. If it pleases you, Tiri Bandagi, then you bless us with your Bandagi, with your meditation. Tu Guni Gihira, you are the Gihira, you are the treasure of all Guni, of all virtues. Ape Har Ek Ranga Hai. Vaheguruji, O Guru Sabji, you yourself are Ik, are the one. Ape Bahurangi, and you yourself go through many colors and are manifested in all colors, all forms. Anek hai, phir ek hai, Jab Sahib Guru Govind Singh Ji says, He is in all forms, but He is one. And ape har ek rang, applying this to the Guru, Guru Govind Singh Ji Maharaj, when they are sitting in their court of Anandpur Sahib, they are the king of all kings. When they are lying in the Machi Vada jungle, with no shoes Upon their feet, the blood blistering out of their feet, a naked karpan, a naked sword in their hand, lying upon a brick, lying upon a stone. They are the fakir, they are the saint of all saints. When Guru Gobind Singh Ji Maharaj is roaring in the battlefield of Pangani, they are the warrior of all warriors. When Guru Gobind Singh Ji Maharaj sits down to write the Bani at Damdama Sahib and explains the meanings of the Bani, they are the sage of all sages. Ape har ek ranga hai, going through all the rangs, going through all the colors. Ape bahurangi, that one Lord. 
pervading through all forms jo tis bhav hai nanak whatever power whatever pleases the lord satguru ji says sai gal changi that is alone good that is the best for me and the gurmukh pyara the one that sikh who goes through all the stages and reaches brahm gyan consciousness of the lord comes to understand this as the ultimate as guru nanak dev ji says in jab ji sab jo tud bhav hai sai bhali kar whatever pleases you that is the greatest tu sada salamat nirankar o formless lord you are eternal forever and forever आपे हर एक रंग है आपे बहुरंगी जो तिस भाव है नानक साई गल चंगी वाहेगुरु जी का खालसा वाहेगुरु जी की फतेह